Prime Minister Datuk Sri Najib Tun Razak says the worst of the economic crisis for Malaysia is over and the country has moved beyond the bottom of the curve. He says the stimulus package that Malaysia had quickly put into place to protect the economy was performing as expected. Our contrarian strategy is performing as expected and the impact of the crisis has been less severe than it would otherwise have been without a stimulus package. We believe the worst is over for us and that we have moved beyond the bottom of the curve. Ladies and gentlemen, the challenge for us now is to ensure that this recovery is sustained. The stimulus package must be allowed to work its way through the system to give the economy the balance it needs. He said this in his speech at the Intrade Malaysia and Kuala Lumpur International Trade Forum on Tuesday, which was read out by International Trade and Industry Minister Datuk Mustafa Muhammad. We'll be monitoring the data on employment, domestic demand and borrowing and investment levels before a decision is made. If the signs are favorable, the food will be taken off the pedal, but not before then. Later, Mustafa told reporters that his ministry and various agencies had set up a team to monitor closely the implementation of the 16 Memoranda of Understanding signed during Najib's trip to China in June. BT has been monitoring them very closely. Uh, we're working uh, once every two months, we get reports from them. Uh, the, the value of these investments uh, is about 6 billion uh, Malaysian ringgit. Yeah? The biggest is a pulp and paper project in Sarawak. Uh, that has not taken off the ground yet because uh, it's doing some uh, details on financing issues. Yeah? Uh, but one, once that takes off, that's, about, that's more than 4 billion uh, Malaysian ringgit, that particular investment from China. He adds that Malaysia also hoped China would also invest in other non-resource-based sectors. Norazan Abdurrahman, The Star, Malaysia.